this video. Welcome to my day as a Saints fan. A massive day for the club. Got to the final of the EFL Cup and I'm on the way into town right now and Durham to watch the game. I haven't looked at the team yet, it's already been announced. Words cannot even begin to explain how excited I am for this match. I really hope we can do it. Let's see if we can. It's starting to rain now, so I'll see you later. Hey. So I'll go through the team if we find a quiet spot, but I just got beat by a car going by. Clearly a Saints fan, good to see. Can we defy the odds and win this thing? I hope so. Now, we've had two weeks off, whereas United have had three games in that time, so we've had plenty of rest. All the players who have been able to play that, that aren't injured, they will be in contention to start. Let's have a look at the team. Okay, so the team is pretty much as expected. Forster in goal. Suarez, Stevens, and Yoshida and Bertrand are all in defence. So Claude Poir has put his faith in Stevens, which we expected him to do. Casares has only just come in, so it would have been very risky to play him. Van Dijk is obviously obviously injured. Um, and then midfield, we've got Ward Prowse, Romeo, Davis, again very strong. And then we've got Redmond, Gabbiadini, and Tadic as the front three. Gabbiadini is on fire. He only came a couple of weeks ago and he's already playing in Saints second major final of the century. So he's really he's really got a he's really got a job on his hands but I really think he can do it. He's such a scruffy lad but he's got an eye for goal and and I think we can we need him today to pull it out of the bag. If he scores he's gonna score early I think and then we'll hold on. But otherwise it's gonna be a nervy one. Maybe we'll send on uh, another striker or another defender and then we'll get a late goal. I really think we're going to nick it 1-0. I really can't see it being anything else. Claude Powell is going to play a tactical game. Lots of defending. Sitting back, letting United have the ball. Let them get tired. Hitting them on the break, just like we did at Liverpool. It worked there. It will work again. Having a look at the team that United have named. Obviously, it's very strong. De Gea, Valencia, Bailly, uh, Smalling, Rojo, Herrera, Pogba, Lingard, Mata, Martial and Ibrahimovic. I tell you what, it's going to be some match for Ibrahimovic against our young defender. But... If he's, if he's not getting the service and we're just sitting back for a while, then he's going to get frustrated, I think. And whilst he might score, I think we'll have enough to beat United today. Let's hope we do, because otherwise this video is going to be so bad. <laughs> the annoying thing is, the rugby is on right now, England versus Italy, so most of the pubs won't show the start of the game. I'm hoping to find somewhere which is showing both. I'm going to keep walking around Durham until I do that. And yeah, come on you Reds, we can do this. Come on lads. Well, I can also with it screening the game, but right now, rugby's on there. There are some Saints fans down there. And the game is being screened on that TV up there. Hopefully, um, when the game gets going, they'll turn some of the TVs over. Only 10 minutes to kick off now. It's really exciting. I think we can do it. Go on. <laughs> what a first half. Gabby Adini scores a perfectly good goal. It's ruled out because, like, the referees are idiots, basically. And United then streak into a 2 0 lead. Oh! Luckily, Gabby Adini pulls on back for half time. We're still in this, but that is the most frustrating half I've ever witnessed, I think, in a cup final. Those kind of decisions have got to be made, right? Oh, come on, you Reds. We can do this. Gabazine has got us. We can do this. Come on, lads. Go on. Oh! Yes! 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 Yes!
No way. Well, that wasn't exactly the result we wanted. Oh. I mean, fair, fair play to them. They scored more goals and they, they won, but like literally the Man United fans in there, I shook one of, the, one of the guy's hands and he was saying that we played better, we deserve to win, but ultimately we've come to the cup final and we haven't done it. When will we get the next one? I don't know, but I feel like from, we can kick on from here. We can, we can do well in the season and next year, just hope we can do it all again. As a Saints fan, we, we enjoyed the day. It was a great day and yeah. Hopefully it will happen again in the near future. <sighs> Congrats United. After 1976, I feel like it's now one all on cup finals. So maybe, maybe in years to come, I'll look back on this and we'll have another cup final against United and we'll beat them. And then it'll be two one win overall. Oh, that'd be awesome. I'm going to head back now. Maybe, maybe I'll edit this tonight, but right now I need to recover. It's, it's been a great day, but what a disappointing result. We did everything right. Gabby Adini, what a player, but it seems that we just can't sort our defence out. Somehow we've lost the defence that we had at the start of the year. Jose Font's gone to West Ham, Van Dijk is injured, and we and whilst Yoshida was brilliant today, and so was Jack Stevens, it just wasn't enough. For both their second and third goals, they would add the freedom of penalty area to take a shot, and we've lost it. We've lost it on the basis of our defence. Anyway, you did the South Coast proud, and no matter what happens, we march on. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video.